So I'm out here with Ozzy and Dolce. Dolce is tracking some kind of animal down there and hope it's not a snake. Dolce. There's a lot of lizards down there, so maybe it could be something like that. Uh. Dolce, be careful. She's, she's tracking, picking up on something. This is that sugar elm, or, uh, sorry, not sugar elm, uh, sugar, sugar berry, sugar berry, or hackberry is the other name. And the dogs love to eat the leaves, so it's really good for them, actually. What's that, baby? Oh, I love this property. It's got all kinds of hiking. Uh, these big boulders and dep depressions and elevations that you can hike. There are scorpions on this land. Uh, now, I'll get out of it. Get out of it. They're scorpions, uh, but luckily I haven't had any run-ins with them. But when the house was being built, they were they were actually in the new construction. And uh, but after I, after I moved in and had it sealed, the house was pretty pretty well sealed up. I haven't had any encounters. Luckily, knock on wood. Uh, what was it, baby? Man, it is. It's like. It's at least 100 degrees outside. I think a little bit over. It's probably about 104 right now. Uh, in this position that I'm in right now, it's uh, not too hot because there's a lot of shade overhead of me. But, but uh, out there in the open, it feels like an attic in the middle of summer. Little sugar berries here. Dolce. Who's that, Azzy? Who's Dolce? Ooh, really? Hot, hot, hot. Where's the Dolce? Where's the Dolce? Alright, well I just wanted to show you all that. See if it was a snake, but luckily it's nothing that she's pursuing. As I say that, she goes and runs and runs after something. Phew. Okay. Oh, I was going to show you this one. This is the Texas persimmon tree. And, uh, see this? A little persimmon developing here. It's going to turn into a nice fruit. Um, I haven't tasted the fruit yet, but I heard it tastes like a cross between a plum and a a plum and a and a prune kind of it's a dark flavor it's a dark f fruit with a with a very sweet kind of prune type flavor can't wait to try it but they they grow like weeds out here there's tons of these trees probably i probably counted at least a hundred of them they just they just pop up all over the place, and uh, cool trees. I love them. Where's that eyes? Where's that eyes? So yeah, middle of Texas, Texas uh, hill country, middle of uh, middle of the day. 
when the sun is when the sun is out right now the temperature gradient i just walked from out of the shade into the open sun and literally man it feels like you're in an attic in the middle of summer it's burning burning heat it always amazes me though there she is this busy bee it always amazes me how on this kind of harsh heat dry harsh almost burning heat that uh you get stuff like this isn't that gorgeous prairie verbena little little wild flowers and uh, the thistle they can take it they can take the harsh elements man they grow right out of rock they're like the worse the soil the drier the better <laughs> i love it Some kind of wildlife. This is this beautiful majestic post oak tree. We got a lot of live oaks out here in Texas, but this is a post oak. Very old, very beautiful. Post oak tree provides a lot of shade. So yeah, like right here is bearable. I mean, I could sit up here under this under this tree. Even though it's 100 degrees outside, it feels maybe about 90 under here. Let's just dig in about, digging for something there. There's some kind of animal. See how he's camouflaged with that tree bark. <laughs> Okay, and there he goes with that trancing that I was talking about in a previous video. See how that uh, tree branch is touching his back. He's going to walk real slow. Oh, sorry. Almost dropped the phone. Yeah, y'all, I need to invest in some better equipment. For like a uh, gimbal or something so I can hold the camera steady. Where is he, Papa? He's on the trail. Back here is where that baby deer was behind the fence. Hot, 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 hot. Yeah, see, there's where that baby deer was. And uh, see, there's where I put the water. Um, it looks like they may, something may have drank some of that water. Can't really tell. Something besides the ants. Okay, Boba. Oh, <clears throat> but I, I just love the terrain of this, of this area. See these huge boulders and the bedrock? I just love it, love it, love it. It's just cool rocks out here. And the rocks, you know, they, they make all these kind of cool, um, unusual formations. So. What is it, baby girl? She's hot on the trail for something. Yo, it's hot. It is hot, hot, hot. Uh, I'm gonna go inside <clears throat> for a little bit. And uh, I think I'm gonna barbecue something tonight. Uh, probably some shish kebabs, maybe some burgers. I love blue cheese, anything with blue cheese I love. Make some blue cheese burgers. So, um, but yeah, so, we will 
go back inside towards the AC. I do, you know, as much as I say how hot it is, I do prefer the heat over the cold. I'll take the heat any day. I actually kind of like the heat. And you know, it's not always this bad. Uh, you know, about maybe three months of the year, it's 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 hot. You know, it's in the upper 90s, approaching 100, reaches 100 some parts of the year. But then uh, the fall is absolutely gorgeous, and and uh, and the winters are are relatively mild. We got snow. We get snow every so often. Not very often, but. But uh, I prefer I prefer a short winter because I don't like to be cold. So the spring and the fall are perfect. 70s, maybe an eight, some low 80s. And uh, so yeah, so so I I I, uh, I can do the Texas weather. Oh, look at him. He's running about something. He might be running to say, "Get me into that AC." I'm done with this heat. What is it, Oz? Oh, what he's running after? Oh. Let me see. What is it, Ozzy? Okay. Huh? Alright, y'all. I'll talk back at you later. Hi, uh. Ooh, air conditioning feels good. Yeah, I'll talk at y'all later. Bye. Say bye, Oz. Oh man, I gotta clean this room. Like to, I like to put lots of water bowls out so they have access to them. But yeah, but yeah, anyway, so I'll talk to y'all later.